So today I decided to land a base on Ceres, and I was planning on docking with Orenity Station, which is this base station right here, which I built a couple weeks ago. But while I was attempting to dock with Orenity Station, I kept running into some issues, so I just had to use what fuel I had left in order to get to Ceres. I just need to do some staging. Alright, I think we should be good to launch. So from here, I attempted to dock with Orenity Station. Twice. Both of those times failed, because the navigation system kept suggesting that I take the brilliant shortcut that every spacecraft pilot knows, which is to crash directly into Earth's surface. I decided to opt out of this method, and just go directly to Ceres. Okay, now that we're on a trajectory to Ceres, I think I'm going to rename this spacecraft to the Miller 1, because the Expanse. What I'm referring to here is the book series called The Expanse, which has a character from Ceres called Miller. I put a lot of Expanse references in my spaceflight simulator spacecraft, just because it's the only thing I can think of a lot of the time. There it is. There's Ceres. Okay, we are now on a trajectory to Ceres. So then I just started time warping closer and closer to Ceres, and then attempted to land. Okay, I'm going to slow down. I thought I was going to completely botch this landing because I kept time warping and I thought I time warped too far because I didn't know how much gravity Ceres had, but I was completely fine, it was alright. Um, I don't think Ceres is black, but I'll probably just retexture it later. And I will keep this rocket intact. Okay, the hard part is trying to get off. There we go. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh. So the rocket is fine. There we go. And I will I will rename it to Star Helix Base. Star Helix is another Expanse reference. That was the job that Miller had. I have been reading too much of the Expanse.